Hey what is going on Counter One here you guys are winners and today I'm going to be doing a video on how to set up Unreal Tournament on Linux. Um, it's quite simple pretty much for doing things on Linux but basically you want to come here download the Linux client yes to the Linux client. To get there quite simply you start at epicgames.com slash Unreal Tournament or Unreal Tournament.com go community forums scroll down a little bit to announcements sorry for the flickering it's a weird bug with uh, Antergos right now when I'm recording the top one uh, will be the latest update and there it is yes to the Linux client or server or Windows server this bottom bit for Linux clients you can get them here that's just extra maps you can get them in game they automatically download um, you do have to be logged in to get to this page uh, on your account. If you're on Mac or Windows you can just go and hit the download now button right up there. So I'm going to get that downloaded and I'll see you in a minute. So when you've got that recorded you're going to want to come to wherever you downloaded it. I've just popped it onto my hard drive. Uh, opening terminal and it is just quite simply a .zip so unzip whatever tool you want to use I don't really care. Uh, bang and it will just inflate everything into this Linux no editor folder which is quite simple um, wait for that to be done and you should be good so I'll see you when this is done so I've now got that downloaded and after that you can just delete the uh, zip folder because it's 10 gigabytes unfortunately you do have to re-download it every time you want to reinstall and update because there's no patch or anything but yeah come back to this guy give me some more views cheers uh, after that you can like close out of there and it will be Linux no editor engine binaries Linux that's where you want to go then you want to open it in terminal and you can see there's a load of things you want to chmod plus x so we're going to make it executable for those of you who don't know ue4 dash linux dash shipping done nice we list it again hasn't changed colour it should have changed colour but it's now executable so we can do dot dash ue4 dash linux dash shipping and then you do the argument of unreal tournament so basically you're launching the unreal engine with the argument of unreal tournament the game hit enter on that and hopefully that happens there we go uh, the game is launched and in a second it should hopefully come up uh, yeah so basically what we've done there is we've changed it to be executable there we go oh and it's loaded my files brilliant so we've managed to install the game now that's a pain in the ass though getting to there is a pain so I don't actually have this game installed on my hard drive I have it installed on my SSD for quicker boot times because that was a long time to wait uh, bas basically you don't want to do that what you want to do is steam you can make a command if you like I prefer to just use steam so we're going to open up steam here I didn't have already open go to steam os and here we go so we've got the properties here now the target you change you go and find it and you scroll all the way down and you click ue4 dash links dash shipping it used to be dash test now it's dash shipping open that quite simply that's the name start in uh, then what you want to do is you want to hit this set launch options and do unreal tournament that's the argument so it's going to be launching the editor by doing this bit here and then the uh, actual game by doing that extra bit on top close out of that save it whatever hit play and it should go there we go that's going to be the SSD one that I've got but I did this is how I did it when I set that one up there we go get an SSD because it's much quicker 
So yeah, that is basically how you want to be installing Unreal Tournament on Linux. Um, you're going to have to update it every time, it's a pain in the ass, but whatever. When you do update it, what you're going to want to do is, if I come back to the desktop here, uh, mine is installed in my documents and then Unreal Tournament, so Linux no editor. Don't delete this Unreal Tournament folder, that's your save. So your um, your keybinds, your video settings, audio settings, your login information so that you automatically log in, that's all going to be saved in that folder there, then Linux no editor. doesn't matter if you move it, you just have to redo that Steam thing. You can make a desktop file, you can do whatever you want to do to be able to launch a Linux uh, binary, quite simply. You, can, you can't double click it, because you have to do that command. You can, however, make a bash script or a, a dot desktop with that command, with the argument command bit added to it. So that's how you make a, that's how you install Unreal Tournament on Linux. Uh, I hope it's been useful for you and uh, go watch Unreal Tournament from whichever week you are in. Hopefully you have a great week, a great time until whatever you're doing. And I'll see you next time.